I know. Hey, Dale, how's it going? Going great. Say, I got a quick question for you. Um, a lot of people are worried that it's too late to plant some of the cool season crops, but we're still a little early for warm season mixes. What's a good way to fill this gap? Yeah, I, I've been getting the same question a lot. Uh, it's kind of late for oats, peas, and spring barley, but too early for sorghum sedan um, and our other traditional summer crops. So what I'm telling people is, is to look at the same crops they're planting for row crops right now, corn, soybeans, and sunflowers. They'll grow at a 55 degree soil temperature instead of having to wait for a 60 degree soil temperature like like uh, sorghums and, and millets, which need even warmer temperatures. So you can gain about a month on the forage production season by planting some BMR corn, popcorn, forage soybeans, sunflowers, just plant it really thick. Uh, the seed is cheap and just plant it thick and you can be out there either cutting hay or grazing as early as June. So after that, um, there's still plenty of time left to get a summer mix in, is that correct? Yeah, yeah, I mean, June is prime time to be planting sorghum sedan, pearl millet, uh, cow peas, sun hemp, mung beans, all the traditional summer grazing crops that we, we've always used. Um, the, the corn, the, the drawback of the corn and soybeans uh, is that they, they don't regrow well after haying or grazing. Um, so it, it would be important to maximize your forage production to plant something after you harvest the, the corn bean mix. Yeah, well, no, that sounds really good. Um, thanks for the tip, Dale, and we will talk to you later. Okay, thank you very much. All right, talk thanks, Dale. Later. Have a great day.